Did you know diasporically that the first Afro-descendant mayor of Paris was an Afro-Cuban man who gained this position even before the abolition of slavery in Cuba? Called the Negro of the Elysee, the Chocolate Minister by French media, Severiano de Heredia y Cardenas was born in Havana, Cuba on November 8, 1836. He was the son of the prosperous, high caste ranking in the social order, mulatto parents, Henry de Heredia and Beatriz de Cardenas. He was registered as a mulatto born free in the parish of Jesus del Monte, now a predominantly black Cuban neighborhood in Havana, after white flight. Some contend his actual father was his godfather, Ignacio Heredia y Campuzano, a wealthy landowner and slave monger. His godfather, along with his wife, raised him from the age of 10 when he went off to France, escaping turmoil in Cuba. He was packed off to France, where he studied in Paris at the Lyceum Louis de Grand, graduating with highest honors in 1855. Living comfortably on the inheritance he acquired upon the death of his godfather, Heredia worked as a journalist, literary critic, and poet. Gaining French citizenship in 1870, he favored universal education, separation of church and state, industrialization, a free press, and child labor reforms. In 1879, Heredia was elected president of the municipal council after six years of serving his district. This post was equivalent to mayor at that time. He died suddenly of meningitis at 64 years old in his home. Two walkways are named after him in Paris. All of this occurred before the 1886 abolition of slavery in his native Cuba. Oh,